Four days after he was linked to a racist photo in a 1984 yearbook, the governor of Virginia, Ralph Northam, continues to defy calls to resign. Chip Reed has more on this story from Richmond. I cannot tell you why he hasn't resigned, but I am so praying that he would do that and get it behind us. Democratic State Senator Louise Lucas is increasingly impatient over Democratic Governor Ralph Northam's failure to step down in the days since this photo was uncovered on his 1984 medical school yearbook page. He initially apologized, but later denied that he is one of the people in the photo. Late today, a group of former classmates issued a statement saying they fully believe Northam is not in the photo and they do not believe the governor is racist. And Republican State Senator Richard Stewart, a longtime friend, defended him, saying poor judgment 34 years ago should not outweigh a selfless service to people from every walk of life. It's an opinion shared by some Northam supporters we talked to today. I feel like we should give him a chance. And you'd like to see him stay in office? I'd like to see him stay in office. When I first heard it, it shocked me, but I knew then I want that governor. I needed that governor. Tuesday! Tuesday! But others in town feel very differently, as do almost all Democratic leaders. If Northam does step down, Lieutenant Governor Justin Fairfax would become governor, but he has been accused of a sexual assault 15 years ago by a woman now represented by the same law firm that represented Christine Blasey Ford in the confirmation hearing of Supreme Court Justice Brett Kavanaugh. To her. For the third day in a row, Governor Northam spent the day hunkered down here at the governor's mansion and in his office across the street while he decides what to do. One person who wants him to stay and fight for his job is his wife. Jeff? Chip, thank you very much.